This is activity 7-6, formatting a chart. Now, this chart here in front of us is a pie chart, and we have been in and out of the chart expert. But we're going to go in and instead of formatting or doing things with the chart expert, we're going to format the chart. Now, we have a wide variety of choices here, right? Common, border, we can add borders, and hyperlink. Now, object name, tooltip, and we can make these, notice, change based upon different conditions, right? So that's one way of formatting the chart. And we'll just go in, Chart Expert, and we can do some formatting here as well with all of these choices. Color Highlights, and these are the conditional ones, adding some text. And General Options. So right there, there's quite a few different things that we can actually change. Now we're going to go through a series of things. Right? So firstly, let's start with the Chart Expert. Now on the Chart Expert, we're going to use a depth effect. Right? So it looks three-dimensional, and it's slightly at an angle. Right? Now, in the data, we have right now product, product name, and in the values, we have show values. Now this is under this advanced option. For each of these, we could change the order in which they appear. We could set the top end. Down below, we can set summary options on the chart expert. If we go to the options tab, we can add our labels or we can turn off labels. Let's turn off the label. Right? In the legend, do you want the legend? And where do you want it to show? I'm going to have it go to the bottom. And layout, percentage, amount, or both. I'm going to turn on both. Right. Color highlight is the conditional one. Now text. I could do a subtitle and a footnote. I'm going to do a footnote. Now down here I can change the font. I'm going to go to Verdana. And let's preview. And let's go ahead or back. Notice the percentage. Here I've added that percentage and I've changed the font in here. And I put this at the bottom instead of at the right or the left. And there's the little extra that I added to this. Quite simple to do this. And that's the end of this demo.